Tina Turner had a blockbuster years ago. What's love got to do with it? I'm going to ask you that question today. What's love got to do with it? I'm going to give you my answer in advance. Everything. 1 Corinthians 13. Though I speak with the tongues of men and of angels, but have not love, I have become sounding brass or a clanging cymbal. And though I have the gift of prophecy and understand all mysteries and all knowledge, and though I have all faith so that I could remove mountains, but have not love, I am nothing. And though I bestow all my goods to feed the poor, and though I, have, I give my body to be burned, but have not love, it profits me nothing. Now, the Corinthians had the problem that sadly we still have in the 21st century. They determined that someone's maturity level was evidenced by their gifting. They determined that if someone could speak in tongues, they were close to God. If someone could lay hands on somebody that was sick and the sick would be healed, that person is really a good and strong Christian. They again attributed maturity to gifts. But what does Paul say? Paul says, here's how you gauge your level of maturity. He said, you could have words of knowledge. You could have all kinds of prophecy coming out of you. You could understand mysteries and all that. But if your motivation is not pure, if it's not coming out of a place of real love in heaven, it's just a clanging sound. My goal today is to get us where we're asking for the baptism of love. Because if we get baptized in the love of God, then the power is going to be released among us.